Yep. What up, YouTube? It's your man's Mad King Leon the Third with another lit video for y'all. Now this video right here is of what I would like to call the most versatile shooting guard slash point guard combo build. He is an offensive threat, six foot, 175 pounds. You have to make him that way if you want the AI similarities, if you want the Allen Iverson type build. Now the pie chart is half slashing, half shooting. Now I know what you're thinking. The build's too short. Uh, uh, uh. When you look at the Giant Slayer badge and the stats that this build has. Now this build has a driving layup of 90. The close shot, if I'm not mistaken, is like 90. The driving dunk is 82, which means once I get to 98 overall, he will have the pro contact dunks. 98, no. Right. 97, my bad. 97 overall, he will have the contact dunks. 98, he'll have the elite ones. Now, this Bill can shoot. He can dribble. He can slash. On defense, he's decent. The perimeter defense is like a 75. Steel and um, lateral quickness is like a 77. He can't get no rebounds, but, I mean, what do you want from him? He's six foot tall. Now... In this gameplay, as you can see, I'm not doing too much dribbling. Why? There's no need to. For one thing, I don't have enough playmaking badges. For two, in this game, you don't really need to do all that. Now, I will, for entertainment purposes, I'm actually in the lab right now. You know what I'm saying? But as you see the gameplay, we just we just out here running it up. Now, this game, we almost lost because I was out here throwing up houses. But, you know, when it comes down to it, when it's time to win, me and Miyaki get the job done. Now, we run out here running it with TakeOver. I think his build was um, like a 70-something overall. He's still building on this guy. I think his guy's an offensive threat as well. Watch me wet that. Bling. Um, so we just run it up. And honestly, I'm going to tell you something, y'all. You don't need three good players. Now, don't get me wrong. We are looking for a oh, solid can... third, like a solid third shooter that has IQ. But, you know, Tick and TakeOver and a few other cats that we're running with, They'll, be, they'll do good. They'll suffice until, you know what I'm saying, they get their player built or whatnot. The good thing is, you know, they're working with us. We get the chemistry going. I mean, just me and Miyagi by ourselves is already a formidable force. I told y'all I like those words, formidable. But, but anyway, this second game, this is the second one of this game. I wanted to see how much contact this build could take at six foot. So you're going to see me taking it to the rack an awfully lot this game. I mean, on some, on some nut stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, See, I'm just out there just on, just trying to take it. See, see what he can do. See how much he can uh, withstand, oh, what he can handle, what he can and can't do in the park. And this is without most of my badges. Now, if you want the actual build, I will do a build video. Just put it down in the comments. Let me know if you want the actual specs on this build. If this build is a dub, <laughs> put it in the comments. It doesn't matter. I'm going to read them anyway. And that's just more fuel for me to master this build. Because, as I can tell, everybody's scared to make a small build this year. Everybody wants the big, tall builds for some reason. And I think 2K purposely made certain builds to be deadly in a small package. Because this guy, I'm telling you, he takes contact at the rim. I got another gameplay coming up with him. And I'm telling you, I'm not scared to go with the, go to the rack with this guy. It, there's oh, no need to be scared to go to the rack with him, man. Plus, even though he's a shooting guard, I'm going to tell you right now, that needle, that needler, the needle threader, or whatever the heck that badge is called, you don't need dimer. You don't even need passing accuracy. His passing accuracy, I think, is like an 82, and his ball handling is a 91. So just wait until I master the ball handling and get that down pat. Oh, I was wrong. This is the second game. Mm. 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 I'm not even paying attention to my own video. But anyway... This game also, I'm telling you, I'm just taking it to the cup, man. I'm just trying to see what he can and can't do. And I'm telling you right now, this build is something special. He's one of a kind. He's <laughs> formidable. I told y'all. Formidable. Everybody else has these shooting offensive threats. 
and the sharp shooting facilitator, and they got the slashing playmaker, the, you know. And, but I'm trying to tell you, man, a 91 ball control, just when he gets to 99, he has a 96 ball control. When you add the boost to it, he's dribbling just as good as any playmaker. His passing, 82 at 95, you get to 99. It's an 87 with the boost. He's dribbling, he's passing just as good as any playmaker. So Driving dunk, can... 82. Get to 99, 87. I'm telling you, man, like, and with the Dragon Slayer badge, I did have the Dragon Slayer badge on gold on this build, on this gameplay. Just wait until I put, either put it on Hall of Fame. I don't know if I'm gonna put that on Hall of Fame or Contact Finisher on Hall of Fame. I'm thinking about Contact damn. Finisher because I will get to 97. I mean, that's a fact. <laughs> you heard me. That's a fact. I will get the 97. And when I get those uh, contact dunks, I'm going to be... Psh, you think I won't? Look at this. Look at that. Look. Euro step. Straight to the rack. He's small. He's quick. He has a speed. And you don't need much strength. When you add the consistent finisher, the contact finisher, the giant slayer, the slippery, uh, slippery whatever it's called, and fancy footwork... Those slashing badges for these small builds make them deadly when they uh, drive to the rack. But anyway, that's all I have for y'all today. If you like the video, hit that like button. Subscribe. Make sure you hit that noti bell. It's been your boy. This is a quick video. It's your man's Mad King, Leon the Third, and I'm out. Yep. Yeah.